What's up, Harper's Bazaar? I'm Dwayne Wade. Hope you guys are ready to go to bed with me. How I start my night is I light a candle first. Hotel Collection, thank you guys. I love the smell of Hotel Collection. So to create my vibe and my energy to kind of wind myself down, I light a candle. I'm all about the vibes. My skincare routine is one of the most important things to start my day and to end my day. So the first thing I do is I start with my face wash. The products that I've been using over the last two years is PCA Skin. These products have been very good to my skin. It's kind of evened my skin out. Um, if you go back and watch some old photos, you will see you know, kind of the discoloration in my skin. So they tell you to just put like a, a drop, it's like a dime. I like it soapy. So I go like two quarters. They lie, but I really like the soapy, so. All right, so get it all in there. Before I start, I know you're supposed to do these soft motions like this. What I try to make sure I get it all in there. This is when I realize how big my hands actually are when I actually put both of them on my face, by the way. Told you guys I like a lot of soap. I like to get the day off me. And so, it's soapy. Probably put entirely too much. I can't open my eyes, so let me rinse this off. Whew. All right, here we go. Mm. And something that's very important, my next step is my toner. Just put some on it, like that. And just really to just even my skin out. So just really just to wipe through, make sure that I'm hitting all the spots, especially this nose, this nose of mine, which is very shiny. I get my hair cut often, so my beard area is a very important area to make sure that I don't have breakouts. So I have to make sure that, you know, this area around the line is really, really taken care of. And so making sure that I, I keep the toner and making sure I keep making my face clean in this area is really, really important. This thing is not want me to be great. <laughs> From there, the next products that I use is, I use a little brightening serum. Uh, and once again, it's something that I use because of, you know, a little discoloration in my skin. And so I just put a little bit on before bedtime. In the morning time, I'll probably go with a lot more than I will. And so just that much from bedtime, just a little bit. And then right here, uh, the boosting serum is something right here that really makes, this is what people think, why people think I have makeup on. And so I go with one drop of that as well at night. It's so smooth, so silky. Mm -hmm. I'm all about that too. When it comes to my face products, it has to feel a certain way going on my skin. Now, even the face wash, it has to lather a certain way. Oh, it's refreshing. Last but not least, acne gel. Um, throughout the day, sometimes, you know, certain little pimples pop up and I wanna make sure I take care of them. So it's important to do it at night. And I only need a little drop of this. And so I normally have little areas of concern around my beard or maybe on my forehead. And so I make sure that the night before, I put a little acne gel on. It's very, very important for me. So just a little drop on my finger. Like that, it's a little drop. And I try to find the area of concern. Right here, I got a little pimple that's trying to, he trying not to let me be great tomorrow. You see him right there? He don't want me to be great, but we are gonna be great. So just a little acne gel in the different areas that is needed um, is something that's very important before bed. In the midst of that, my lips. I got big lips and they like to be dry. And so in the midst of this, I make sure that I put a little lip balm on uh, before I go to bed. It keeps them soft, you know. This is very important for me as well. Um, just the same way as I want to take care of my skin. What's very important for me is my overall skin, is how soft my skin feels. Um, even when it comes to having tattoos and all the things, it's really stand, making sure my skin stays hydrated. And so just make sure that, and it smells so good. And I'm about scent. I wish you guys could smell it. It's this vanilla body butter by Prowley um, company that I'm a part of that we made this. And for me, it's really just about one, I want to smell good when I hit the pillow, but also two, I want to keep my skin soft. And so a little body butter before bed never hurts nobody. And I like to look in the mirror. It makes me feel good. A little lavender oil right here. Um, shout out to um, Donato Skin Food. I get manicures and pedicures, and so I gotta take care of my hands, I gotta take care of my feet. And so before I get in bed, I make sure I dab a little bit of this on my hand, and I take care of these feet. 
keep your feet soft, man. They don't have to be hard. You don't want to scratch a woman or you don't want to scratch anybody. I'm not going to bother showing you. Y'all don't want to see these things down here, but just know my feet are soft and I take care of them. Also too, I spend a lot of time on my hair. So shout out to Nato for giving me the barber brush to make sure that I could travel with it and take care of my hair. And so I just go through a quick little, quick little brush to try to lay my hair down before I put my do-rag on. Um, in, the, in my community, in the black community, this is one of the most important things to travel with, to always have, is your do-rag. And so I've been laying my hair down, trying to get waves since I was a young kid. And it's no different now as a 42 year old man. So do-rag at night, but I try not to put it too tight because I don't want to wake up with these lines all on my head, on my face. So I just lay it on there real nice. Do rag, do it. Once I get done with my routine, I think it's very important for me to journal, to end the day, and to be able to talk about you know everything that you experienced, everything that you felt. And so I just sit down and I just allow my feelings and my feels and everything to happen to just, to just come out. It's time to go to bed. I'm gonna go journal. You guys, please go check out my podcast, The Why with Dwayne Wade, and have a good night.